Hello, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to look at these Illumi noodles. Um, I picked them up in Asda this morning. They cost me uh, £1.20. Um, I have seen them in there before, but I just kind of walked past them and just ignored them. But today, I actually picked them up and decided to have a look at them. So there were two different flavours available on the shelf, and I opted for the sweet chilli rice noodles, um, mainly because I like hot spicy food and it's got a 2 out of 3 rating there for the chilies, which would be quite good, hopefully. So they come in a little tub, a bit like a pot noodle kind of tub, and it's got a clear top, so you're able to see just at the side there that it's got some noodles in there. The ingredients to the things, if I hold it where the camera can see it, there we go. So it's got rice noodles with rice flour, tapioca, it does contain the celery, um, but that's about it. It also says it's got some dried jalapeno peppers, which hopefully will be quite good and it'll give it quite a bit of a kick, which is what I'm quite looking forward to. Nutritionally, it's not the greatest. Ooh, hold it when I can see it, there we go. But it's not the worst either. Um, one thing that's interesting, you can see where it says fat. You've got per pot 1.1 grams, and the saturates is 0.5 grams. Now if you turn it around just a little bit here, it says it's fat free. Now I don't quite understand that, so if anybody understands how it can say they're fat free and how it can say there that it actually contains the fat, then please let us know in the uh, the comments down below. So yeah, we're going to follow the uh, the destructions to it, and we're going to make it, and we're going to see what it tastes like, and hopefully it's going to taste better than a normal pot noodle would. If I could find where the instructions are. Oh, there we go, in that big box that says preparation instructions, right. Empty the seasoning sachet over the noodle block, same as a pot noodle. Add boiling water to the fill till add boiling water to the fill line and stir. Replace lid. Leave to stand for four minutes. Crikey, four minutes. Stir well to separate the noodles and enjoy. Right, okay, let's give it a go. Kettle on. Away. Top comes off. You can see in there noodles. They look like uh, they look like kind of plastic, plastic things. They look like I'm dropping them on the floor already. It's all right. Then empty the sachet. doesn't give you an instant smell of chilli, but as you can see on it, it says Illumi sweet, sweet chilli, and it was packaged at quarter to two in the afternoon. Let's pour it out here. Yeah, you can see there's bits of um, jalapenos and some other red chillies in there. So, right, so that's all pulled in. Um, I can't really hold it up that well for the camera. But yeah, you can see there's bits of green in there, and that's about it. Right, so, here's the question. It says, add boiling water to the fill line. Now on a pot noodle, they always added, there was a line on the outside, and it was marked. Um, 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 if you've seen it, leave us a comment. Um, uh, right, I think we're just going to have to guess it, or else otherwise I'll be stood here for the next half hour going um, and wondering where it is. So let's guess it to the top of the noodles and see how that goes. But it did say approximately 300 mils, didn't it? Because so, right. there's no line. Never fear glass jug is here. Good old Pyrex. 300 mils. Did it say 300 wasn't it? Yeah it was 300. Alright let's just pour that in. So, right, so there you go. So if you get one of these yourself, let me just, that was about 300 mils. So that is just above the noodles themselves. Right. 
cover with lead. If you can get the lid back on. Oh, bloody, get on there. Alright, that's on. Alright. Start stopwatch. Right, there we go, that's the four minutes up. Um, it says after four minutes, stir well to separate the noodles and enjoy. So let's open the back up again. And the inside has gone a bit like a noodle, noodle soup. You can see bits of rehydrated, whatever it is, green stuff floating in it. The noodles do actually feel really, really papery at this stage. You can't really smell too much of the chilli. Uh, there's plenty of steam coming off of it, but... No, even when I hold it up to my nose, you can't... There's no chilli smell there at all. Um, what's in the ingredients? Potato starch garlic powder you can't smell, dried red pepper, dried spring onion, that'll be the green bits, salt, onion powder, ground ginger, colouring is the paprika extract, they would have been better off using real paprika I think, chilli powder, lemon juice and dried jalapeno peppers, yeah there's no smell there at all for anything to even imply it's slightly sweet chilli. Okay, so let's give them a taste and let's have a look and see because it's got the two out of three chili heat rating on it. Yeah, that's nice. Well, they're edible, yes. Um, that's about as far as I'll go. There's no taste to it at all. Um, absolutely none. Um, as for the chilli right, uh, yeah, there's nothing, absolutely nothing there at all. That is a huge disappointment. I was quite looking forward to these. They are going to be quite hot. Let's just try another one, just to make sure. There's a slight taste of something there, but it's not, it's not chilli and it isn't anything that would make you go, oh wow, I love sweet chilli things, or oh yeah that's definitely a 2 out of 3. So let's grab the spoon out, let's just give some of the sauce on its own a go. I'll take some of the sauce there, let's give that a go. Um, there's a little bit of a kick to it, just the sauce on its own, but again it's nothing that's I'd really write home about. Um, I'd give these a 4 out of 10 <coughs> and say yeah, you can eat them and that, but they're edible, but they're not anything special. Okay, leave us a comment down below if you've tried these before. Okay. If you haven't, leave us a comment. Let us know if you are going to try them after we, um, after we just gave them the 4 out of 10. Hit the subscribe button and we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Right, I don't normally do this, but I'm just stood here eating them. Um, I've eaten down that much because it's my lunch for today and it does seem that when it says um, on the sides there um, stir well to separate the noodles it should also say stir well because chances are all the chilli and everything else is going to sink right down to the very very bottom and it's going to be at the very very bottom where you're going to get it all so you really need to stir it well even though you saw me stir it then the stuff down at the bottom is actually quite hot and quite powerful so because of that, I would say stir it well and we'll up it to a 6 out of 10 because we are getting down to the chilli stuff at the bottom.